Hi guys, it's Angie with Fun Endeavors Tie-Dye Lab. Today let's make a watercolor ice dye. I've prepped the shirt like normal and I have it turned inside out. This is a long sleeve shirt that I'm going to do today. It's also a ring spun cotton shirt, so it's a little bit softer shirt. I'm adding some tall deep scrunches to the shirt and then I'm going to cover the shirt with ice. I want this shirt to have more of a grayed out blue feel to it. So I've chosen some blue and gray colors to add together on the shirt. I'm going to lightly sprinkle each of the dye colors over the top of the ice. I'm using Grecian Sea from Dharma, Alpine Blue from Dharma, Brushed Steel from Dharma, and Blue MX2G from Custom Colors. Now I'm going to add an additional sprinkle of soda ash over the top of the dye and then set the shirt aside and allow the ice to melt. Here's what the shirt looked like after all the ice melted. I just left it alone and allowed it to continue to process for 24 hours. Then I took the shirt to my utility sink and I began rinsing it in cold water to rinse out the soda ash. I went ahead and warmed it up to hot and continued rinsing to rinse out any of the excess dye that didn't bond with the fabric. When the water was almost clear, I put the shirt along with a little bit of Dharma's textile detergent into my washing machine and washed it using a hot water cycle. And after the shirt was washed and dried, this is what it looks like. Okay, so what do you guys think? This shirt kind of reminds me of a stormy night. The way the dye moved on the shirt and then the color patterns with the gray and the blue, I just... Every time I look at it, I always think of either a stormy sea or a stormy sky. I think it looks really pretty. I like the color splits and I like the color combinations, how there are lighter parts and darker parts. It definitely has a very watercolor feel to me. And that's what I was going for. So overall, I'm really happy with this shirt. I think it looks really pretty. So if you guys have enjoyed watching the video and the content of the video, I sure would appreciate it if you would like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you all for watching and I hope you have a great day.